Welcome back. With us now is Tammy Monday with Sumitomo Electric's Human Resources Department. Thanks for joining us, Tammy. Thanks, Tanya. It's a pleasure to be here today. So how did you get involved with the Warren County Industrial Training Consortium? Well, I'm fortunate to have worked for one of the companies that started the consortium back in 2004. Uh, three local companies, Bando, Dessa, and NASCO, joined together to form the consortium in order to offer training to their employees. And the consortium is managed by a board of directors, and um, I have been fortunate to have been the president for the board for the past two years. Tell us about the partners involved. Well, we have excellent educational partners with Western Kentucky University and the Bowling Green Technical College. They actually provide the curriculum that we offer as a part of the training classes. And then through our partnership with the local chamber, we have access to resources for grant writing and also financial guidance. What makes the industrial consortium unique and a benefit to those involved? Well, I think the benefit to our membership can really be outlined through our tagline, which is uniting industries, sharing cost, and building success. Through uniting industries, most of our companies in our membership are industry-based. So the training content that we offer will apply to employees who have very similar needs. And when you get a group of employees together sharing ideas and solutions, hopefully that information can go back to their place of work and be applied there. Tell us about the cost-saving benefits. Well, we share cost. I think that is the greatest benefit to our membership because they get good quality training at minimal cost. The classes that we offer are held locally, so there's very little disruption to the work schedule. And the class uh, cost is shared among all of the employers who actually participate in the training. And I think this format is really good for that employer who might just want to train one or two people and do so at a minimal cost. Expand on building successes. Well, through training, an individual improves their own skills and their knowledge. And then hopefully they can take that information back to their employer and apply that in their workplace. And this way it's really a win-win situation for both the employer and the individual. What type of training topics are often the focus of the group? Well, today's workplace is very fast-paced and ever-changing, and it really demands that employees' skills stay current so that the employer remains competitive in the workplace. And through the consortium, we hope to offer uh, classes that meet these needs by offering a variety of business and technical classes, such as leadership, management, lean manufacturing, and team building. We also hope to meet uh, some of the business concerns of today, such as communication and generational differences, as well as diversity. And of course, we offer traditional uh, computer courses, such as Excel and Access and PowerPoint. How are the classes presented? Well, we have two class formats, either your traditional classroom instruction or online classes. And the online classes have really taken off over the last couple of years. We introduced them back in 2007. And I think that they give the, uh, the student the flexibility to learn at their own schedule. The consortium has scheduled its first program of the year. Tell us about it. Well, we're real excited about the training plan that we have in place for 2010. And in addition to our normal class schedule, we're excited to be able to offer an executive leadership program. The program, titled Managing Up, will be presented by nationally acclaimed professor Dr. Carrie Solly. And Dr. Solly is a professor in the management department with Louisiana State University. His program, Managing Up, discusses the, the process of consciously working with your boss in order to achieve the best results for yourself, your boss, and also for the company. And the consortium is happy to be partnering with the chamber in order to present this program not only to our membership but also to chamber partners and the community as well. What are some of the things that people who've attended Dr. Soli's sessions say about the experience? Well, from all reports, he's a very energetic presenter, so we're real happy to be able to bring him to Bowling Green. Some of the quotes from past participants are, Carrie has an energy that is contagious, which brings the class together, and Carrie is a dynamic speaker and presenter. And actually, in 2007, Dr. Solly was recognized by Business Week magazine as one of the 12 favorite business professors within the United States. Where will the training sessions be located and is there a cost? The Managing Up program will be held March the 5th here at the Chamber of Commerce and the program time will be from 8 to 11.30 with registration starting at 7.30 a.m. The cost will be $80 per person. 
How would those listening who are interested register? Registration is going to be handled through the chamber and electronic communications will be going out soon to our membership as well as chamber partners. Of course, if you're interested, you can always contact me at Sumitomo to get more details about the program. Anything else that our viewers might want to know? Well, we're just real excited to be able to bring this program to Bowling Green and we hope that our local leadership will take advantage of having executive training right here at home. Tammy, thanks for being on the show today to share the details about this upcoming event. Thank you, Tanya. Again, it's been a pleasure to be here. I'm always happy to talk about the consortium, and we're real excited to be able to bring this program to Bowling Green, and I uh, hope that everyone takes advantage of it. Thanks again.